It's almost 10 weeks now since we started the first planting on the uh, field lab trap cropping trials. Uh, today I'm at the site uh, of Furnaces Farm uh, at Cainton near Edgemond. We've got a terrific site here. The site is also surrounded by a commercial crop of sisim, which Mr Furness has grown himself. The trials on this farm have worked really well. Uh, we've had an excellent establishment of both species. Uh, there is slight differences with regard to the uh, germination uh, at the different sowing dates, which is what we were looking for. The Sassimbrifolium has proved to be uh, slightly better in terms of establishment on this site. Um, it's looking really well now and as you can see uh, it's in mid-flower and uh, hopefully it's uh, releasing a lot of exudates to um, help us reduce the PCN uh, numbers on this field. Other sites, uh, we've had um, slightly less success than we have here at Cainton. Uh, on the heavier, wetter soils, we've had very poor germination. Um, it's really affected it this wet summer and uh, unless the soil has been uh, freely draining and um, and providing a, a sort of a, a, a comfortable dry seed bed for the seeds to germinate uh, we've had very poor establishment. With regard to the uh, two sowing dates uh, the Early July uh, uh, sites are looking well, uh, whereas the end of July sites uh, it's almost too late. I would say probably the 10th to the 15th of July is looking like being the latest uh, safe sowing date. Hopefully this will fit in with a few um, winter barley crops. Weed control has been a real issue on some of the plots. Uh, it's something that we're going to have to have a close look at uh, next year. Um, it's all very well establishing these uh, crops, but we've also, also got to have a, a good way of uh, keeping them clean.